Today the topic of our discussion is what is dot plot hybridization technique a very short summarized video. Why we need dot plot technique? It's a technique that is used to detect the presence of a specific sequence of DNA or RNA in a known electrophoresist sample. Normally the procedure what we do to find out a specific DNA fragment is southern plotting and for RNA fragment it is northern plotting. And the principle is hybridization. The probe will bind to the target DNA and forming a double stranded DNA so that as the probe is radio labeled we could identify the probe easily. Let's move into the detail. The steps in dot plot technique. First of all we need to purify either DNA or RNA of different samples as per our requirement. Then this is a nitrocellulose membrane or a nylon membrane. Nitrocellulose membrane is preferred as it has more affinity for nucleic acids. So we need to apply the DNA or RNA samples as dots just like this. So denature DNA as it is double stranded and fix it by baking at 70 to 80 degrees Celsius for 2 to 3 hours. So we are applying samples, each sample as dots on this membrane. Next step is after fixing, we need to add the prop. Prop should be labeled, either radio labeled or labeling with some kind of substrates that will give color reaction. Then incubate for hybridization. Prop is a DNA or an RNA sequence that is complementary to the target sequence so that it can bind to the target sequence forming a hybrid, either DNA DNA hybrid or DNA RNA hybrid. Most often the prop will be DNA. So it is actually probing the target sequence and forming hybrid with the target sequence. Next step is wash of excess or unbound prop. In this step we will be removing unbound prop. And finally if it is radio labeled auto radiograph or placing an X-ray film above the membrane then we will be getting black dots indicating the presence of sequence in that sample. Here these black dots in these samples the target DNA we are looking is present in these samples. So this is a highly simplified technique compared to southern and northern plotting. So what are the advantages as we discussed? It is simplified method of southern, northern or western plotting. In the case of western plotting the procedure is the same. The difference is the principle is antigen antibody interaction. Then it is cost effective very easy method compared to northern and southern plotting but remember not that much reliable as southern and northern plotting and other advantage is we can run many sources of sample in a single run it's very quick so to find out the presence of a specific DNA sequence of many samples all on a sudden dot plot is a method of choice and that's it about dot blot technique thank you so much for your support you are with biologyexamsforyou.com